Hey, welcome to the Daily Dose. Let's dig into it. So today I want to talk about, you know, how are you leveraging meetup type groups and seminars, right, in your business? Now, this might not apply to all of you that are listening today, but for those of you that are, you know, maybe in the consulting or any of the service space stuff, right, um, there's a really good opportunity to uh, do meetup type groups that are value added type groups. I do one right here um, in my town right here with small businesses as a, a give back program every single summer. I do that for free. But it ends up being a conduit or an acquisition channel down the road. It's not a today money thing, but it ends up working out in the future. That's the whole give, 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 give value for as long as it takes, right? And if you, you know, I think one of our meetup groups is like 7,000 people in the meetup group. 7,000 business owners are in that meetup group. So we, we do this business building thing every single summer with them and help them for two or three days. And inevitably, some of those turn into clients down the road. It's a very powerful tool and you know it takes some time to build it but it it really it there's a lot of juice there for that for sure then you have the seminar angle right of throwing seminars that are similar to like a meetup only you might have it in california or somewhere else right you bring guest speakers in and and this is like value add stuff not just junk. The thing I don't like about masterminds and stuff like that is most people walk away with 30, 40 pages of notes and no action steps to get there, okay? So inevitably what happens is that book gets thrown in a corner and nothing happens. If you do a seminar correctly, you do have the value add but then on top of that, you have a step-by-step -step to implement whatever that service is that you provide to implement that. And there's betterment that happens from it. It's not just a notebook full of junk. All right. Anyway, so those are two great growth strategies for 2023 um, for you to look at. Um, and I hope this was helpful. If it was, smash the like button. And as always, you can reach out to me at www.strategicadvisorboard.com. And remember, go dream it, believe it, you can always achieve it. We'll see you on tomorrow's episode.